Mark's um, gone out there and exposed himself to a, to a number of opportunities that, that, that were given to him uh, and also gone out there and, and looked for opportunities himself and uh, from our point of view at the University of South Wales that's something that we embrace. My journey at Shrewsbury Town in the community started at Ludlow College. On leaving Ludlow College I was encouraged to join the Foundation Degree Programme by Steve Brotherwood, a coach from Shrewsbury Town. So I joined the degree programme in August 2017. From here I've had some fantastic experiences and opportunities that I've been very grateful for. So I'm now classed as a member of staff here at Shrewsbury and I deliver on a wide range of projects which include soccer schools, ADC, mini kickers, walking football and shoes ability. So the Kick Cancer Programme is a programme for anybody who is currently got or recovering from cancer. With the Ling and Davis Trust we got to plan, deliver and review the project which we are really proud of the work that we have done. I signed up to pedal the pool probably rather stupidly and didn't do, didn't do much training for it. We all managed to successfully get to Blackpool in time for the kickoff, and we, I think we raised over £2,000 for the charity which was a fantastic effort by all. So I signed up in January 2018 for the trip to Ghana with African Adventures. So whilst we were over in Ghana then we had the fantastic opportunity to experience maths, English and multi-sports and teach two local schools over there. Mark has just been an unbelievable ambassador for the course. Um, he shows quality in, in everything he does and it's a testament to himself um, the way he comes across in, it, in his day-to-day -day activity here in the community and it's going to be an unbelievable opportunity for him to progress in whatever career he does based on this course and I think he's inspired a lot of the other, the other students with what he's done this year and um, we look forward to seeing him progress in the future.